New game. Oh, it's Spirit Fair. I don't know I what that is. I would have remembered. Neither do I. If I would have remembered, I would have remembered to say that had my computer just tried not to kill itself. Finally. Uh, thought for a second you would never wake up, little one. Why is it X? How ironic that would have been. How ironic that would have been, would it not? I'm Sharon. Always oh, a spirit fairy. Well, that's what I've been until your arrival. I not say that I am sad to leave, but I still had a few things left to do here. I'm afraid you will have to pick up things where I left them. It is, after all, my very last day. And you are... Stella. Welcome, Stella. I see you brought a friend with you. What's his name? Uh, I think your friend... Oh, okay, I was like, uh, I think he Daffodil. died. I think we're both dead. Run a literal river of blood, it seems. Yeah, and he just... Well, he said... It, he said, uh... Wouldn't it have been ironic if you didn't wake up? So... The dead. Yeah. You two, you two will share the burden, then. Take it over from me. As I said, in a few minutes I will be gone from this world. And that is why you were here. You will be the new spirit fair. Your task here will be far from easy, but simple nonetheless. Go fetch stray spirits stranded on the islands. When they are ready, bring them back here. Dying souls can't pass away on their own. We'll have to help them fulfill their last requests and be at their service until their last breath. But if they're already souls, they're... dead. The big round bridge over there is the Everdor. The Alpha where everything starts, the Omega where everything is. It's not really a bridge. This is where all the quests get completed and where existence meets its threshold. Or some shit like that, I don't know. There is no task more important than this Never forget this, Stella. Here. There's something I need to give you. Now be really careful with it. It is the Everlight. The symbol of your status here and the only tool you will ever need. Wait, who are you? Highly inappropriate. Well, that settles it. The ever light will help you through your travels. It will be the light that shines in the darkness, the last reimagining, or no, remaining hope of the departed. Okay, so we just became the Grim Reaper? Technically, I don't think so. I believe this is the dude on the river sticks. He's not the reaper. He's just the dude. Huh. Hope is a flame, the light that never falters, the beacon of eternity. It is heavy and inconvenient, but there is no greater duty than this one. The fate of lost souls rests on your shoulders. Look, I was overwhelmed too at first. Really? Big, large, scary dude with sharp fingernails. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, did you start off looking like us, or did you... Just keep your focus. Take it one step at a time. We'll soon get used to this place. Accustomed to these moments. You are the new spirit farers, after all. And one last thing. Once I'm gone, you'll have to find a ship of your own. Mine is not suited for you, and it will fade away once I'm gone. You might find one not too far from here if you keep rowing in the right direction for some time. Probably. It is time. Here I go. So long, Stella, and good luck. You will need it. Fuck you, guys! It's all nice, but then it's just a dick right at the end. 
He's like, yeah, if you keep going through this path, you uh, you should be good. Or not. There's I don't no fucking know. Hmm. I guess at least you get a, an, a, a cat to accompany you. Oh, I'm playing now. Ooh, this is pretty. Oh, there's something down there. Who the hell is that? Oh shit, that was weird. X is interact. Stella! Oh. Or I guess it's you. Well, it really is you. Stand up straight and let me get a good look at you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You look good. And Daffodil is here too, I see. Mm -hmm. Who the hell are you? We'll have to find a lint roller then. <laughs> ah, it might not be that obvious after all. Mm -hmm. It's me. Gwen. Stacy? <laughs> good thing you found me. Mm -hmm. But if you're here, it means... Oh. You are the new spirit fair. You are the one replacing... Sharon? Sharon. I called him Sharon. Okay, Sharon. Uh, I was trying to get rid of him only... I was trying to get rid of him and only ended up here by accident. Why were you trying to get rid of him? <laughs> I've been stuck on this disgusting island for about a week, living off... Sardines and cigarettes? They're cigarettes? Mm -hmm. Ew. I guess if you can't... I mean, you can't get spirit cancer. Yeah. Funny how I used to be the one getting out... Getting you out of uh, trouble before. I can see you have an Everlight now. Mm -hmm. Yep. Of course. See that boat over there? No. Uh, oh, shit. That's a big-ass boat. Sweet. She's like, yeah, you can't have that. <laughs> That's the one. It's obviously slightly shabby, but let's commandeer it. Alright. I'd wager it will work since you're the spirit fairer. Okay, meet me on the deck over there. I'll explain it all. Oh, cool, you just can take us with you? I guess I'm taking her with us. Uh -oh. I'm the spirit fairer, it's my fucking boat. Hey, you got a couch. Over here. Mm -hmm. Okay, here it goes. Hope my fur coat won't be too damaged. Fur coat? Uh, are you a deer lady? You're a deer. Oh god. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. <laughs> I'm not <laughs> I'm not one to jump for joy, but this feels good. Much better than anticipated. Mm -hmm. So why is this deer smoking cigarettes? I have no clue. Why is she wearing a fur coat? Or is it just her... I don't know. Whatever. The way I see it, this boat is yours now. Don't you think? Good. And as you're the spirit fair welcoming stray spirits, it's your new job. And once abroad, they oh will boy. aboard... I'm sorry. My brain is dumb. Uh, they will... Assume their true mm -hmm. forms. Well, it's my theory anyway. Mm -hmm. Why Let's are you hug. looking at me at? Uh, hug. Why is it using the X button? Mm -hmm. I don't know, but this is strange. Mm -hmm. Why are you hugging her? Much better. Come with me now. Let's take a look at this chaos. My couch. Oh no. I can't get off the couch. Oh. What a mess. Reminds me of Aunt Petunia's old yard. Who the fuck are you? Shit if I know. Those are your lines. Oh, a beautiful unorganized testament to someone's laziness. Or a vital impossibility to get rid of anything. At any rate, we should do something about this. Or must or my dust allergies will be back. Let me think. There's only one way to clean this up. You you have to meet Albert. Mm -hmm. How's Albert? He's your local ship 
ship right. And his jokes are garbage. So is his ship. But he's the only one who can fix your boat. Mm. You should head to Albert's shipyard. You must be wondering how to make this ship move. Mm -hmm. with the wheels. It's really easy, actually. There, let me give you this key I found on the island. It will unlock that mm -hmm. cabin in the back. You should find a map projector in there. How do I know? All, do I know all this? Well, I was planning on, es on an escape, remember? Mm -hmm. And you know me. I plan things meticulously. Very mm -hmm. meticulously. Da -da -da. Go open up that cabin, mm -hmm. Stella. The map projector should be very simple enough to use, and you just have to go to Albert's shipyard. I just want to let you know, I have a very hard time reading out loud. I don't like it. We're in theater. Oh, God. It, I don't like... I don't like reading things out loud that I don't know. Like, if I read lines that that's different because then I'll know what they are but like you know in school when they had us read like I yeah they always had me read because I was the best at it okay well for some reason she would always make me read but I didn't like it because I didn't want to say a word wrong and sound stupid that's also why I didn't oh shit oh nice uh sometimes I in my math class he would ask us questions and I just wouldn't answer it because I I wasn't sure if I was right or not and I just prefer not to be wrong. I, I got a pairing. Nice. Okay, there's pairings out here. Huh. I'm dead, but I can still fish and smoke. No, no, the, the other lady smoke. I guess I can smoke if I want to. I guess. Shit. Couch time. Oh. Pet my cat. I want a cat. You have a cat, a very, very fat one. Oh, she's so, she's so chunky. I love her. Oh. Oh shit. Uh, Oh, it stops. It will automatically. Oh. Huh. Well, how do you. Oh, okay. And the cat is. On the. On the Everlight. Hmm. Oh, sweet. Nice. I don't know how to do this. Another one right there. There's a little boat down there, I guess. No. Oh. oh, my goodness. What? What's up? Give me a hug. Sorry, I'm okay. Now. Shh, bitch. Frick you too. The ship is powered by your ever Everlight. That's how it cruises the ocean and reveals the, star the stray spirits. It also explains why I couldn't do anything by myself. I must admit, it's quite fascinating. Look, I know you must feel overwhelmed. Sharon, the Everdoor, the Spirit Farers, this place, this boat, me being here. It's a lot. You must be wondering what's going on. Truth be told, I don't really know either. But I'm here for you. Do my best to help help you and try to make sense of it all. As I said earlier, I wanted to leave him by myself, but somehow I just couldn't. Now that I see you, I think I know why. I'll give you some space for now. Don't hesitate to explore the ship. You can even give that fishing rod a try. Already did. <laughs> yeah. Rolls your oyster. Oh shit, here we are. Now head down to all oh, shit. Albert Shipyard. Discovered. It's very pretty. You're very pretty. It's the only way to clear this clutter. I'm curious about what it's all made of. Considering the smell, I'd say at least seven different types of dirt and dust. Uh, just get some Febreze. And close your eyes. It's fine. Seven different types of dust? Is that what she said? I guess you don't like dust. Mm. What's up, Albert? Welcome to my shipyard, young traveler. Where my prices are a customer's best friend. I'm Albert, a fucking shark. Been in the business of shipbuilding for ages. Should I assume you're the new spirit fairer? Well, of course you are! Anyway, you've been able to start this ship and bring it here, bring it here after all. I've this right to point you towards my humble enterprise. So let me see what you have. Nice little dinghy. Funny how it looks exactly like the one I built some time ago and stored in my old shipyard. Yeah! <laughs> that is weird. Huh. Shit. 
Oh, See, Sharon wasn't happy about his gloomy and dank arc. Actually, he was always complaining about everything. But the customer's always right, so I built him a newer, better one. Of course, he would never abandon his previous boat, and old habits die hard. But don't worry, you can keep this one. Let's just call this alone. And let me tell you something. You know we always joke, joke about the construction here. Don't worry, we're still working on it. Anyway, with a little bit of love, and this bird will be... Splendid again? First thing you'll need is a proper blueprint table. Since your lucky day, I'm feeling generous. I'll offer it to you. Free of charge! Mind you, it's just a bit bare bones in terms of functionality. But the subsequent upgrades will come at such a small price you'll want to buy them almost immediately. Simply direct direct me to upgrade the ship. Upgrade the ship. Beginner. What happened? Did it just get cleaned? That is not but cheap. I don't I'll, I'll have any money. There you go. Oh, I gotta keep talking to you. We'll be able to build and edit your buildings on your boat. What a treat. But if you really want to upgrade your boat in size and in pleasure, I'm your guy. Come back when you feel your boat is getting a little too crowded. Crowded. Cheers. Alright, sweet. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh no, no, no. Oh, oh. Well, I want to pet the kitty. No, it's my kid. It is not your cat. It's my cat. No. I'm Stella. It's my cat. No, I'm Stella. I hate you. Albert gave it to you for free? And he said he loaned the ship to you? Ominous. Hard to know what, what he has in mind, but it doesn't sound reassuring. Anyway, let's focus on the task at hand for now. Cleaning up this deck. You can go to your new blue, blueprint table above, above your cabin and select the move option. In it, you'll be able to remove any building and get back resources. Go for it. I'll wait down here. Oh, you have a hammock for a bed? Neat. I thought... No, no, that's the map. That's the map room. Uh, up there? Oh, shit. Look there. That's what I thought it was, but I Edit. wasn't sure. Select. Salvage. You got two old shoes and a carpet. Nice. Oh, wait, my couch! Oh, no! <laughs> Great, where the heck am I supposed to lay now? Great, I don't know how to couch. It's fucking fantastic. Oh. Stupid deer. You did a wonderful job, Stella. The good news is that you have enough resources to add a guest house to your ship. A necessary amenity. Oh. Newly welcome spirits, such as myself, will have a temporary place to relax and sleep. Well, sleep, not really. I can tell, f I can tell you for sure that no one will be thrilled to spend more than one night in here, in there. But it beats sleeping on the deck. The stars are pretty, but the wood is stiff and the humidity is hard to tolerate. I'll leave you to it. Have fun. Maybe um, it wouldn't be so hard to tolerate if you weren't wearing a stupid fur coat. You could have freaking stayed on the couch. Is all I'm saying. Guest house. Oh! That's pretty cool. Oh, you can't go farther than... I think I can put stuff underneath it. Yeah. Hell yeah. That's what I want to do. That reminds me of when we were thinking about getting... Uh, not a bunk bed. What is it called? Shit, I missed it. Loft bed. Oh, there's a couch. Oh. Fuck you, you took my freaking couch. Also, there's a picture of us in here. The guest house is very pretty. It has your touch. Nice work as usual. Now at last, I have a place to sit down and enjoy the view. Oh, wait. What's going on? Something else is happening. I didn't realize that's where it was going, so... <laughs> I should have expected this. I'm actually hungry. Very hungry. You know how terrible a cook I am, but I remember you being absolutely fantastic at it. And you might have fished a few fishes already. Fishes? Trouble is, I can't really eat an entire raw fish. I could try for sure, but I'll probably choke on the fish bone and never survive. We're, we're dead. Yeah, I was like, are you already dead? That's not how you want me to go. As absurd as this sounds. So you should be able... You should... So you should keep using this blueprint table of yours and build a kitchen. I'm pretty sure I've seen plans for it in there. As well as the necessary resources. Damn. 
You require bright jelly. Uh, what? There's only one way to get some. Look, I should have told you when I first met you here. Something scares the hell out of me. A dark presence, and even I cower from it. A void that swallows all, light included. It can take many forms, and for me, it's always a jellyfish. Yes, I'm fully aware of the irony. The bright jelly you need for the kitchen. Well, only these jellyfish can provide it to you. So there is no other option. I have to face my fears. But you're here! And with you, I can do it. And they will appear as dark as a dark patch of pure fear on your map, so you can't miss it. Go, I'll take some time to prepare, from, prepare, the, uh, prepare myself. Alright. I guess it's that. What's this thing? Uh, oh, it's just fish. Might as well get more fish on the way. Well, you're sitting on a chair, but behind it, it looks like one of those, uh... Tackle box, probably. Nice. Another fish. Very calm. Oh shit, another fish! Kinda waiting for it to- oh damn it, I gotta shoot. Kinda waiting for it to just go nuts and scare the ever living shit out of it. Well, she doesn't like- oh kitty! No, I want another cat. No. You but have an alley, she's like three cats. But she's not here. And then you have Big Black. And you have T'Challa, and you have all the little babies. Oh, but the Mexican man in front has them. And you won't let me go. Oh, damn. You won't let oh, me god. go. Oh, god. Oh, god. Oh, god. Okay, go oh, up. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, no shit, here we are. Here they come. Remember, set your eyes on the ones with bright jelly. They should be visible enough. That said, pop as many as you can. You'll get glimpsed that way. I'll wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay out here. Hey, go ahead. I believe in you. What the hell am so I doing? So not gonna help? Alright, I oh, guess- So how am I popping this shit? Oh, you just- Oh, okay. Really? That's- That- Oh, that's a big one. Hold on. Cool. Not hard. I really can't tell if this is what I'm supposed to be doing. I, I, yeah, because it shows it on the, um, down there, how many you've caught. Oh no. Uh. There's a lot of these guys. Oh, the big one. I swear you could jump higher. Maybe I'm just... Oh, the green. I think those are especially the ones you're supposed to get. Yeah, because she said... I gotta get all these glims. Yeah, you gotta get those, but Whatever like... glims are. Make sure you get the, Wait, the green. Wait, is that currency? No, go. Ladder, 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 ladder. Gotcha. Bitch. You can see her in the back. Smoking. Give me your corpses for money. There's the big one. Nice. Blah, blah, Why blah. is this scary? Uh, I mean, they don't, it's they, don't even, it. they don't even sting you. It's kind of weird looking, but. Yeah. All right. I guess we're. We did it. We did it. We did it. Yeah. What? Oh shit. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. You know the people at work, some of them call me Dora, and it's not funny. I'm really impressed. You rocked out there, tumbling and diving like a shooting star. And yeah, that's what I figured to do after I was given no instruction, you went inside to hide and smoke. And without the slightest fear, no hesitation at that. We're dead. What can, what's gonna happen? You definitely haven't lost your touch, Stella. You even gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. Go for it. Be patiently waiting, slowly digesting myself. 
I'm about to freaking skin you. Uh, I can build a field? Hell yeah. Oh, shit. No, shut up. Lovely. Let's cook something. My recipes I got. Nothing. Nothing. Let's, let's cook some muscle. Cook it. Oh god, that would be freaking hot. So, you now use the kitchens up. It should be rather simple. Put any one ingredient in the oven and wait for it to be cooked. You could even try these loose corn kernels that have been hanging around in my pockets. I don't... I don't like that. Yeah, I don't like that. I can't wait to see you in your cooking glory again. You got this. So she said pockets, so I'm guessing that is another f actual coat on top of her. So she's Cook wearing, faster! She, like, skinned a family friend and was like, I'm just gonna fucking wear you. Yeah, well, that works. Yeah. It's like when you... Sorry, kitty. It's like when you, um, give me a hug and then say that you're my shirt. Either that or our friend's a furry. Yeah. I, I got... Remember, it's... Steamed shellfish! It turns into whatever you need. Also... that to like cook Hold on. recipes oh okay so when you make it it becomes a recipe I guess but it's really interesting weird but I would yeah. like oh wait this cost money what oh you got whenever you and I sell it and whenever Let's you cook got some those, grains uh... Fast. Oh shit, I was I was really fast. Oh popcorn. Nice. I was thinking like just corn. Well she said loose corn. Uh loose. The pictures of an ear of corn. Yeah, I know. But how were they supposed to I guess uh -huh. You can put an ear of corn in your pocket. No, I was gonna I say. Got lost popcorn. Right, I was fish. gonna say, how would they show that? Uh, I don't know, just a loose corn kernel. Just give me some food. All right, have some, have some popcorn. Mm. Thanks, Stella. That's better than I could have thought. Than I thought it could be. But then again, you've always been a wonder in the kitchen. It's popcorn. Don't forget, spirits don't run on sunshine and water. We need a good meal once in a while. It will be up to you to understand who's fond of what. As for me, I'm sure you'll remember I've always loved comfort food. And that I could die for a cup of coffee. Aren't you already dead? But I'm not that picky. I can eat anything. Just never the same thing twice. Oh, and before I forget, here's something I was supposed to give you. Not sure exactly how it works, but it's, but it's an oval. But an oval is a symbol of passage. It's a fee each spirit has to pay. Something tells me you knew that already. No? No. <laughs> Didn't. This is news to me. All right, let's keep on improving this craft. As you must have seen in your blueprint table, there is a there is both a field and garden blueprint, which means you can grow many different things and turn the ship into an adorable farm of sorts. You should add a field first, in my opinion. It's going to be easier to find the resources for it around here, and you can grow linen in it, which in turn will be used to craft more things. In addition to building a field, we should go buy seeds to use in it, but that will come later. I need you to visit an island close by. It's called... Moss Stein Cove, and there's something on it we need. I'll tell you when we get there. Hey, uh, my fish! Is your yeah? I was gonna say. Oh my god! Oh my god! I wonder if it burns. Real no. fish. Stella. Yes. I forgot to tell you about this. As you can see, the boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your ever light being light, or some other technicality. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want. 
tackle and finish business, or just chill on the deck under the stars. I suggest you go to sleep too in the cozy little room atop your cabin. You'll wake up refreshed and ready to go, and the ship will start up again in the morning. Oh, and speaking of that, you know me, waking up on time has never been my forte. And you can ring that bell over there to wake people up. Remember, only do it at the right time. Early morning should do the trick. Speaking of sleep, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow, Stella. Have a good night. Sleep till morning? Yeah, sure. Nice. Cute. Hmm, I wish we had Wowie here because I love when she used yeah, to she's sleep too fat with me. Though. No, she's not. Too fat. She is a very too fat. She was very comfortable when she slept on top. No, I couldn't breathe. Too fat. What? Crushed my lungs. Oh my. <laughs> That's why she laid on DC's top. DC's way too big. Oh. Too heavy. Yeah. But he's so handsome. Sun ain't up yet, let's fish. Oh, gotcha. What I got this time? Chew. Chew. Oh, no. Uh, aha, Ooh. a herring. I'm hoping there's different fish. Let's go to the map. And... Oh, that's that's Mostyn Cove. Mostyn Cove. These are just crates. Let's go there. Yeah. There's it's resources. seeds and stuff. Get some seeds and shit. Wake up! Oops. So, not only do we have to lead them to their next destination, but we Got have to feed cook them and for shit. them. Cook. Sucks ass. Here, fish. That's a piece of cake. It's yeah, not a fish. I was... Yeah, whatever. Okay. I wonder if you can make cake later. Can you shoot that bird? I don't and have some chicken. With what? <laughs> I had to use my body to defend the ship from jellyfish. I don't think we got guns here. It said your Everlight would turn into whatever you needed. It didn't. It could have been a rifle. It chose not to. I feel like for the jellyfish, it could have been like a. What the hell was. Oh. Oh. Come on. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I think it took it out too early. Shit! Aww, uh, you're gonna have to kick it again. Got some shit! It's a lot. You need a lot. Oh, oh. Empty shell. I can't really do much with that. Oops. You can dive. Oops. Maybe that's just where the. Oh no. Okay. Copper ore. Oh, I guess it was just one. Shit. That's like a whole boat. Yeah. Oh, we stopped. I forgot. This was the destination. Now we have to go to uh, some islands. Yeah. Fish to get done cooking. So what? What made you choose this game? Meow, 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 meow. People were talking about it, and it was on Game Pass, and it looked pretty. Oh, okay. It's also apparently supposed to be a lot more chill than the games we've been playing. Yeah. Brand new, put it up on the channel, might get some views, might not. 
brand new game and I want to play it. And it's a good relaxing game. I got enough videos on Alan Wake. Week, Jesus Lord. Alan Wake and uh uh, we haven't. We don't have any pathologic videos right now. We've got another destroy all humans video, so we should have enough for the week. Probably put this up this week anyway. We get to this cove. I said, keep fishing. See if we can get any other special fish. Eventually, I'm gonna find another person, I think. Or being. whatever they. their true form is. A thing. Oh, uh, old shoes. Old shoes. These better be useful. And yeah, something. like, what if people uh, need shoes? Well, you need shoes, not old shoes. Mm -hmm. Look at that! We should hop on that island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. Alright. Seeds for the future! Let's go, was cat. She, was she supposed to come with us? I have no idea. <laughs> I just, nice! I just straight up stole that. I got an empty bottle. And oh, okay. Some... So she... Here we go. Magical tree. A majestic tree. Well, you can cut it down. Yes, it's fine, I promise. It's the best way to get wood wood you need, actually. Don't worry, they'll regrow over time. Another interesting fact about the Everlight is it comes with weapons. Oh, a saw. <laughs> oh, your little kitty. Oh, oh, that's... Ooh, okay. <laughs> He's just holding on for dear life. Ah! Okay. Give me wood, damn it. Oh, okay, good, we got wood. Congratulations, for you become Death, the destroyer of worlds. Jokes aside, that's how you do it. I'm gonna go on ahead and cutting down more trees. Then we can go back to I mean, go back to the boat, build a field with all those maple logs. I'll be next to the raft. Thanks for the help. Ooh, I was gonna say raspberries. Raspberries. You know what I was craving the other day? No idea. Uh, one of those blueberry push pops. Yeah. You didn't like blueberries. I don't like blueberries, but I like blueberry push pops. <laughs> like the artificial flavor ones. Oh shit, what the hell? Okay. Uh. Try that again. So you have to... That limestone. It's an interesting mechanic. You gotta hold it down and then time it. Okay, there were like two trees. Okay, I guess that's all you get. Then my two trees. And some limestone. Oh, and wait, oh, you're the stuff that I stole. Go back to the boat. Wait, 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 wait. To review active quests. Build. Well, feel. We need to feel. idea of attaching a field to a house. Okay, I might need to move that over. Or maybe not. A field! It's better looking than I thought. There's a little genesequa to it. Simple but elegant. 
Now all you have to do is plant field seeds in here. Seeds can grow only in their respective places. Garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't try. But you know me, I would kill a, pla I would kill a plastic cactus, so don't take my word on this. Anyway, there's only one place where we could possibly find what we need. Theodore specializes mm -hmm. in seeds. One of the chipmunks? He has set up shop in the- Shut up. He has set up shop in the Hummingburg, the busiest town in the area. Theodore and his brothers- He's got brothers. Okay, they might be raccoons. Raccoon Inc., a shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. It sounds like the chipmunks. This is world is a serious problem of dubious business practices. Since I don't want you to get swindled, I'll come with you and do most of the talking. I've run into this cheeky little raccoon once, and his dishonesty was blatant. Let's head to Hummingburg then. We just need to find some seeds from the field. Okay, so he's a raccoon. Wow. And his brother's <laughs> Simon and Alvin. Crates? Seeds and treasures? Let's go there first. Help catch more fish. You notice that I haven't eaten. Curious, do I have to eat? Should I eat? Uh, I don't see, like, Should a I health feed bar. my cat? No, you don't see a health bar. I'm dead. I don't know. Let's cook some raspberries. Ooh, I wonder if it'll turn into pie. You need a lot more than just raspberries to, to make pie. Yeah, and you gave her <laughs> fish and she... <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> what? Nothing. I know what you're laughing at. <laughs> I'm gonna tell my dad he's no. gonna beat you up. No. Yes. He's tough. He's like this big. So? He ain't thick like me. Just because he has tiny legs does not mean mm. anything. Mm. I got them big Stamport legs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like your dad. I mean, you what? Up, man. Uh, <laughs> I got a rock! Oh, quartz. Pie. My pie! Oh, poached fruit. I guess you do need more shit for pie. Uh. Nice. I got a corn turning. seed, coffee beans. Oh, it's almost. I guess you can start moving it towards the course so that it can start going to that other place. Probably won't reach it, but... Forgot my bits in here. Oh, I thought you were going to go cook the turnip. Turnip? You got a turnip. I got a turnip? Yeah, it was in the crate. Oh, I got a turnip. Turnip. Oh, now I'm cooking fish. Okay, that's fine. I just figured the... Hey, the dear. Recipes. Don't ask me how, but I've met Albert already. He's definitely a shark. His interest in all things maritime will be helpful. Such as the boat upgrades he sells at, out at an outrageously high price. With those, you'll be able to cross ominous weather barriers in the world. They look like classical mythical challenges again. They look like classical mythical challenges again. A bit cliche, if you ask me. Uh, would you like some food? Have some of the. No, thank you, Stella. I'm not hungry right now. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. oh the kitty. Just trying to go outside. No, I knew you were trying to kiss the cat. Mm. No. Oh, come here, kitty. No. 
Oh shit! I was gonna. I was gonna. Scrap like... that was in the oven. Now, there's no other like menu, so I guess I can't feed myself. I guess I have to wait for the moon to go all the way up before I can go to bird. Turn it, turn it, turn it. Yay! It shouldn't take that long to cook. If you say that, am I? Oh shit, keep doing that. It might be like the longest of all of you. Yeah, that's pretty long. See if we can catch some fish. Oh. Oh, you made it. You can't get off, I'm guessing, but. I caught something. What I get, what I get, what I get, what I get, what a fuck. An old shoe. Go to bed. Wait, the this turnip. Is, this is bullshit. Okay. Sleep till morning. It'll be fine. She was gonna go talk to you. She can go talk to herself now. Oh man, it's not very nice. Oh, I'm dead. I ain't got time, but not. I mean, you have all the time in the world. Nope. You're dead. I got a job to do. I'm spirit for her. I'm a her. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> What if you like woke up and your ship was just on fire? What happened? And you're like, oh no, what don't, happened? Don't judge me. Just like your mom. Her ship went on fire, it's just her house. Yeah. Wake up, damn it! You got shit to do. Sun's out, dick's out. For Harambe. No, that's not a saying. I just said it. That man's a saying. You say lots of shit. Oh. Ah! <laughs> I'm out here looking for the right house to start a family. My wife sent me out to find something that might fit our needs. A garden, maybe a pool. I'm not asking for much. Just ask for a pool. I just can't decide. I know that you can't help me, but it helps to say it out loud. I might stumble on the rarest to find. Cool. It's my house now. Uh, Alright, just invaded Simon's house. Stole oh. a bunch of shit! Didn't see that. Hope my next game will be ready soon. I've crunched the data and spent five nights theory crafting. Clearly, if you take the heavy weapon f proficiency from the mountain gnome race, there's a nifty synergy with level 3 rogue ability. Ev eviscerate. It's sure. It's for sure a bit weird, but hey, 5D20 and auto critter prone on prone can't be defeated, am I right? I guess I still got D&D. Alright, dear, what you got? Take a good look at the shrine, Stella. It's simply stunning. Some objects in this world are meant to resonate with the spirit fair and the Everlight. I've heard this monument has the power to enhance the Everlight's abilities. The two slots on it need to be filled up. I'm fairly certain you could use oobles to activate. But to get oobles, oobles or obbles, you need to welcome more spirits on your ship. I'm sure you'll soon find more lost souls like me. Oh yeah, you only have one currently. Wait, there was some another house back there. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm in a bit of a rush. Alright, cool. Fuck off. Oh, let me guess. I'm a bit of a psychic, you know. Your name is Mary or Margaret Missy! No. Ish? Ish? Don't tell me it's shoot, I'll get I have a friend named someday. John. You ain't got a friend. Okay, an old classmate. God. I do have There's friends. There's Theodore. Go ahead, take a look at what he's selling. What's up, you fat fucker? Aw, oh, man. <laughs> Step right up, potential prospect. Welcome to Raccoon, Inc. We've been servicing the Humberg since forever. You've got the glims, I've got the goods. I've got all the wares to make you spend those hard art. Are you having a stroke? Possibly. Step right up. It's been a long day. Step right up. And what you got? Here, little fucker. I can, I can just buy a key. Cool. No, five hundred thousand. 
I thought that you were selling that. Oh no, he's. Oh. We have 380. <laughs> we ain't got shit. Oh my god. What do you mean? We can't buy any of this. Well, yeah. We're, that's what I meant. Like, it's everything's like a thousand. Those prices points. are out of control. Come on, let me get away with this. Are you ready to see me obliterate the merchant? Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. Why not? Let's go fuck him up. Theodore! Know what you're doing here? You should be ashamed of yourself, you trash panda. People like you are the reason we have middle fingers. <laughs> what? <laughs> I was pretty damn Madam, good. what's the meaning of this? My friend here is the new spirit fair, but she's not a newbie, and neither am I. That little scam of yours won't work on us. But I I can assure you my business practices are quite above board. Be warned, you treacherous striped weasel. I won't tolerate this behavior one more second. No more shenanigans, no more double crosses, just fair prices. So stop being dishonest at once, and the next time I see you, I'll try being nicer. You start being smarter, you got it? But, uh, yes! Yes, of course! I, I promise you'll- uh, I'll adjust my prices. I beg you, please don't scold me anymore. I'll even give you a discount. Next time I get an argument with over. someone, I'm just gonna be like, you're the reason that middle fingers exist. Yes, you! Your friend really gave that already greedy- that greedy merchant some hell. You both look like you could possibly- Join the upstairs crew. You want to come up, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool being up here. Yeah, all the best people are up here. Don't get too excited, though. Some idiot broke the ladder. You have to be able to jump and humanly hide and make it. Guess you could also use the stairs in the house. Oh, shit, well, I can skip that. Well, anyway, see ya. Upstairs crew forever! There's some weird ass people, people so here. Nice. Yeah, that's better. I need some linen. Mm -hmm. Take some corn. Coffee beans. Carrot. Turnip. More linen. <laughs> Fantastic. Got everything you need, I'll take my leave. Feel free to stare as long as you want. I'll meet you at the pier. Nope. Damn. Uh, there is another house over there that I don't think you walked into. That one. Oh, Gym? I guess you have to go down. Oh, uh, maybe jump. No, no, no. Get out of the house. Jump on top of that thing. Nope. Can't. Uh, what about- okay. I simply adore your hat. Our local shop, Raccoon Inc., only carries garbage wares. Seeds, logs, rocks, all useless items. I need me a hat like yours. Okay. Where does people Give me your there? soul and I'll give you this hat. There's some weird ass people in this joint. Let's get back to ship. Hmm. Looks great! Now you can plant seeds in there. Give it a go. Okay. Oh, is it gonna show you what seeds you're. Hmm. Yeah, it does. Oh, I like that. Corn seed. Water your thumb is as green as your hat. This boat will soon become a cozy floating farm. Don't forget that you probably have to water your plants once in a while. Don't ask my word for it, though. My gardening knowledge is as limited as my father's empathy. You got some issues, don't you, woman? You have to find better mentors than me. Which reminds me. I believe it's time for you to find new people. Not that I don't love the idea of just the two of us cruising the oceans, but you are the spirit fairer, and spirit fairers find spirits. Yes, help them fulfill their last wishes, however mon mundane they can be. I've heard of a place not far from here where someone might be in need of your help. And I'll bet you like and I'll bet you'll like this one. If he is who I think he is. Go. Let's sail. But are you supposed to add okay, water? How do I, yeah, how do I water? <laughs> oh. Oh. That was simple enough. Get my magical belt buckle that does everything. Texan? 
Wait, hold on. I'm delighted that you're here with me. I'm not surprised one bit. It adds up. You're here, taking care of me in my final hours. I've always cared so damn much about others. I've always protected those you found vulnerable. Even pedantic snobs like me. Remember the day my father dealt with the cat? We just got out of we just got out of elementary school and you we were wearing those blue sneakers with the glittery tang tags. And there you were, yelling back at my father like you were on a mission. My father turned red and smashed the purple Del Delano face. It's rad. So are we like schoolmates? I have no idea. I don't know why I went to school with the deer. Shit's weird. Uh, you want some muscles? Is that shellfish? No, 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 no. Not She's for like me. So Sorry. Cool. I don't got any goddamn soul food. You want some poached fruit? I'm oh, sorry, Stella. You know I can't eat fruit for the life of me. I've tried. But I just. You're a fucking deer! Mm. Have some veggies. Mm. Bitch, Alright, <laughs> right, where the hell are we going now? Storms. Hmm. Oh, we can't go there yet because our ship isn't strong. Or, uh, gotta, equipped. We gotta build some shit, looks like. Or, we just end the video here.